He's on administrative leave and two police officers on administrative duty after a traffic traffic stop. This traffic stop uh, ended with one man dead. Good afternoon and welcome to the Fox 8 4 o'clock news. I'm Chad Tucker and I'm Natalie Wilson. This all started when Forsyth County deputies tried to stop a driver on Louisville Clemens Road around two this morning and deputies say the driver took off firing shots as he led them on a pursuit that finally ended on US 421. That kept the road closed all morning and into this afternoon. Fox 8's Daryl Matthews is live on Peace Haven Road just north of 421 where this ended with a driver dead. Daryl, has that road since reopened? Yeah, Nellie has been in the portion of that has opened up the wreckage as well as the debris has been removed. But we're still trying to learn why the deputies attempted this traffic stop with Alexander Holland, who's originally from Charleston, South Carolina. The deputies say that he led them on a pursuit that ended in a crash on the northbound lane of 421. They say Holland fired shots during the pursuit when deputies fired exchange gunshots also. Winston-Salem police and state troopers joined in in the pursuit. We know one Winston-Salem police car was hit by gunfire. Investigators say Holland finally stopped and when he got out of his car, he brought a rifle out with him. That's when he was shot. Holland died at the scene. People living in the area tell us about the commotion that woke them up early this morning. I heard multiple gunshots. I heard a lot of sirens. So um, I was worried because it was super, super loud at first. I thought it was fireworks, but then it sounded like gunshots. So um, I got scared because I'm like, this area, stuff like that doesn't happen. Now, one deputy was taken into the hospital for treatment. He has since been released. The State Bureau of Investigation is looking into this shooting, which is standard protocol when an officer involved shooting happens. They're coming up at five, the technique law enforcement agencies use to stop Collins' car. We're live in Winston-Salem. Darrell Matthews, Fox 8 News. Daryl, thank you. We'll